Kim Jisoo, popularly known as Jisoo, is a singer and actress from South Korea. Jisoo made her public debut on August 8 as Jisoo Turtle Rabbit Kim. According to Jisoo, she chose a middle name for herself because she had always wanted one. Jisoo Turtle Rabbit Kim was born afterwards. She can be addressed as Rabbit, but not as Turtle, Turtle is forbidden. She debuted as a Blackpink member in August 2016 under the YG Entertainment label. Welcome back to K-Pop Megastars. To know more about the ultimate black pink fandom Jisoo, continue on to our channel. And if you haven't subscribed, please subscribe the channel and click on the bell icon to get notified whenever a new video is posted. On January 3, 1995, Kim Jisoo was born in Gunpo, Jeonggi Province, South Korea. She has a brother and sister that are older. She practiced Taekwondo and played basketball when she was little. She wanted to be a writer and painter. She loved the Korean boy band TVXQ. Jisoo attended the School of Performing Arts Seoul for her high school years. In her 11th grade, she joined the school's theater club and participated in auditions to gain more experience in the entertainment business. Jisoo resided with her parents, siblings, and grandparents prior to her debut. After making her acting debut in a cameo in the 2015 television series The Producers, she had her first starring role in the JTBC series Snowdrop 2021-2022. Jisoo and Jenny's friendship is known as Jensu. The nickname Jenduki, which combines the names Jenny and Jenduki, which means clingy, was given to Jenny when Jisoo claimed on numerous occasions during show appearances that Jenny frequently clings to her. According to Jisoo, she is the one who usually wakes Jenny up. The name of their ship, Jenchu, is a combination of Jisoo's nickname, Chai Chu, and Jenny's name. They both served as M Countdown's guest MC. Jisoo would be the member Jenny would choose to date if she could. According to Jisoo, Jenny is her wife. They became great friends when, three days after first meeting, they went to a sauna together and engaged in an in-depth discussion about their dreams while completely naked. She played a heartbroken girl in the music video for Spoiler Plus Happen Ending by Epic High, which was released in October 2014. She played Bobby's girlfriend in High Sahan's I'm Different music video the same year. Along with labmates Sendara Park of Two and Eve, One and Kang Soon Yoon of Winner, Jisoo made a brief cameo appearance in the 2015 KBS 2 drama The Producers. With the release of their single album Square One on August 8, 2016, Jisoo made her debut as the oldest of the four members of the girl group Blackpink, joining Jenny, Rose, and Lisa. Jisoo is a native Korean speaker who also knows Chinese, Japanese, and English. In Gallup Korea's yearly surveys, Jisoo was placed as the 10th most well-liked K-pop idol in 2018 and the 17th in 2019. She came in sixth place among female K-pop idols in a study of South Korean soldiers completing their national service in 2019. Along with band member Rose, she is the third most followed K-pop idol on Instagram as of February 2021. She was included in the Bao F500 in 2019, which is an ultimate professional index of those influencing the $2.4 trillion fashion business. Jisoo was included among the top 10 influencers and celebrities in the cosmetics industry for the first five months of 2020. According to Women's Wear Daily, a trade publication for the fashion business, Jisoo topped the list for average engagement per post, followed by Rihanna and Kylie Jenner. Despite having the fewest posts, just 12 in total, she came in seventh overall. The lone East Asian on the list was Jisoo. Jisoo's fashion sense in the teasers for Blackpink's song How You Like That gained a lot of attention on social media in June 2020. Famous people and influencers in South Korea, China, Thailand, and Vietnam have imitated Jisoo's tubo haircut and makeup. She invented the dot style of makeup, which became popular on social media sites like Instagram and helped spread word of the challenge to admirers abroad. Jisoo came in top place on the Korea Enterprise Research Institute's ranking of the girl group's personal brand reputation. The institute used data from brands and online consumer behavior to identify factors that have a big impact on brand interest and consumption. 
Siam Sunlim, director of the Korean Language Research Institute, remarked that the global Korean wave was quickly overthrowing the traditional Western cultural supremacy and cited Jisoo and Jungkook as global beauty standards rather than stars Olivia Hussey and James Dean. Jisoo started working as a regional ambassador for Dior Beauty's cosmetics line in December 2019. Jisoo was chosen as Christian Dior's muse and modeled for the brand's fall or winter 2020 collection the following summer. Jisoo covered the 155th issue of Dazed Korea in September 2020 and spoke about her work with Dior. Jisoo appeared in photos taken in December 2020 holding the Lady Dior and Delight bags from Dior's Cruise 2020-2021 collection. Jisoo's endorsement of Dior Beauty's Dior Forever Skin Glow Cushion led to its exclusive distribution in Korea in January 2021. While carrying a Dior Carol purse, she also advertised the company's spring or summer collection. Jisoo's long-term relationship with Dior was solidified the following March, when they named her as one of their new global ambassadors, alongside Cara DeLevingne and Natalie Portman. Jisoo started working with the company in May 2021. Fronting the Dior Fall 21 and Dior Vespa ads as the June cover star of Elle magazine, which was distributed in four nations. Jisoo served as the face of Dior Addict Lip Glow, a recently released lip balm for the Dior Beauty series. Jisoo appeared at the Dior Resort 2022 presentation in Greece's Panathenaic Stadium in June 2021 while donning an all-white linen dress designed by creative director Maria Grazia Chiri. Jisoo went to the Dior Women's Wear Spring or Summer 2022 show in September 2021, which was presented at the Jardin des Tuileries as part of the 2021 Paris Fashion Week. She sat in the front row close to Pietro Beccari, the chairman and CEOs of Dior. Before the show, Dior's social media channels included moments from her trip to Paris, including her visits to the house's eight layers, the inspiration for the Spring or Summer 2022 collection, and the Lady Dior archives, which was named after Princess Diana. Along with other ambassadors Enya Taylor-Joy and Sharon Alexi, Jisoo was named the face of Dior's addict lipstick line in February 2022. Jisoo appeared in advertising for Samsonite, Smart Uniform, LG Electronics, and Nikon before making her Blackpink debut. Jisoo was appointed as the second brand ambassador for Nexon's video game Maple Story in March 2022, following Olympic archer Kim Ji Diok. She is, in fact, stunning and vicious. Jisoo, who is well known for her ironic responses, never fails to be the most relatable team member and makes us all chuckle. She may not speak English very well, but she is able to interact with her followers and give them memorable experiences. Jisoo undoubtedly takes her role as the group's oldest member extremely seriously. She is frequently spotted taking care of the members, and they depend on her as well. Jisoo is skilled at soothing the group's members and making them laugh. You have it then. Even though Jisoo is less well-known than the other members, people who know her well recognize what a treasure she is. If you like this video please give us a thumbs up and subscribe to our channel.